Welcome to Mini Metro and my attempt at the daily challenge. This is Melbourne on normal mode. Apparently. Yesterday I think it was Osaka. Oh yes, I like Melbourne. I must have played it relatively recently because I like the filled in station blocks. They're more station shapes. I just like the fact they're filled in. I think I mentioned the last time I played Melbourne. I've been to Melbourne quite a, quite a few times, and it's definitely worth a visit if you're ever in that part of the world. It's a very, very nice city with very, very nice people, and plenty to do. There you go, there's my advertisement for Melbourne. Oh, and I forgot. I tend to turn it on to, f to double speed for the first few weeks of the game to get things moving right along. Okay, with that one like that for the moment. Okay. Makes it a bit more interesting. It's a nice, sedate, easy pace at this point. Hmm. Well, that makes it a nice, sharp angle, but hopefully I'll get another station out this way at some point. Oh, I'll take bridges while the opportunity presents itself. Normally the first thing I go for is an extra line. However, if it's going to offer me two bridges, as the first thing it's going to offer me, I'll, I will take the bridges. Okay. Well, on the plus side, when that train reaches the end and turns round, I'm going to make that into my first loop. And that got rid of the sharp angle up there, too. Now, it would be nice if it would give me some other shape underneath this river. But apparently it doesn't want to. Okay, and I've got a sharp angle back, but if I do that, that flattens it out a bit. So far everything seems relatively under control, although the orange line is starting to back up a little bit. Good, now I'll take an extra line. Okay, we will put that one on that, that line, and now I've got four, four circles in a row on the green line, so I will give that a second train too, or tram as the, the case may be. That's not exactly wonderful, but I might as well connect it like that be honest. And I have two spare lines and only the one spare train. That helps a little. But hopefully, well I'll get a, another, another train, or another tram, at the end of this week. And I wonder what else it will offer me. But apparently I still have three spare bridges. Okay, so I will take a carriage. It's the most kind of it. All the things it could have offered me, a carriage was possibly the most useful. Or the most... The, the best thing I could have that I may not actually need to use just yet. kind of sucks because now I've got five circles in a row. But I wanted that use that circle to flatten out the edges, so now you my friend can have the carriage. Because I'm going to need it. Otherwise I'm gonna have to start using an emergency line down here because 
I need a triangle or a, yeah, a triangle preferably rather than anything else. Well, I'll use one of the spare lines to do that for the moment. That's not helping. What I will do is connect that to there. Ah, okay, a tram. Another carriage. Right, now I'm going to connect that to there. Oh, great. There and there. Actually, I'm going to get it to there as well. Not great. I'm going to put another one of these on here with a carriage. That should manage to take just enough of that. Well, okay, that will help there and there. as time goes by. But hopefully I'm... Well, at least it's a different shape. I've got enough bridges for the moment. But I really kind of don't as well. Because I'm having a little... Plan. If I do that, that will flatten out rather nicely. But I used the two extra bridges I just got. So that should make life a little more efficient. Apart from the fact the orange line is now going to be busier. I'll see how that goes. The orange line may get another train. This scenario seems to be currently in love with giving me circles. Which is not the most brilliant thing it can be doing. That's not going to help either, is it? Because whichever way I do that one, I'm going to get some kind of bad angle. Yes. Yes, the orange line is going to need its third keep calling them trains. They're trams in, in Melbourne. Oh good, another tram. Another two bridges. And... You can have that tram that line. Is that going to help at all? It's going to give me a bad angle, but at least there's another triangle in that general direction. I guess I could start to slow this, this down so I have more time and control. However... Yikes, missed. I hate it when I do that. I think I'll get to, get to Sunday if I last that long, and then I will slow this down. Ugh. Not great, but okay. And equally not great. Tram, another carriage. You have the carriage, and we'll slow you down. So I actually got some kind of control of what's going wrong. And what's going wrong is basically too many circles. I've scored over a thousand, which is always better than 
better than not. In fact, that's a way of free Oh, I've done it again. Yes. If you ever watch this mini Metro developers, please move this lock thing away from where you close where you tell it to delete a line. It's annoying, it is painful, and it takes the joy out of the game for me. And equally weird, now playing this on normal speed, which feels slow slow anyway after so many weeks of playing it on fast speed, is that yesterday I think the daily challenge was Osaka, and that had bullet trains as well. So I kind of got used to the Osaka speed with bullet trains, and now I'm playing on normal speed with relatively non-speedy trams. So it just feels a tad weird. Okay, where's the most likely problem going to occur? Probably here. Because I have a spare tram that I can use if necessary. I just haven't decided where I should put it yet. Oh, I could go out and get another line and so I could do something with this and flatten one of the corners probably wouldn't be the worst idea in the world, to be honest. If it gives me the option of another line, that's probably what I'll go do. I have enough bridges? Right. thinking is, if I do that, that, and that, 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 and then preferably that, and now it apparently it's not going to let me join it. Okay, we'll drop that one off there, and now connect that one. And another circle. And whilst you may enjoy going around that way, turn around and go that way. off the green line so it doesn't become a complete pain. Okay, it's a different colour from the... Yeah, th this this fifth line colour is just a bit too similar. Okay. That was weird. Oh, another circle. Where am I going to move you to? Yeah, about down there. Yeah, it's a bit too similar to the third... the, the kind of turquoise line colour. So it's kind of hard to differentiate them. Oh, I can't do that, can I? Fair enough. I'm just watching, I'm trying to preempt trouble spots, but there are just too many circles down this way. There's no way I'm going to be able to preempt them all. I 
must admit, score-wise, this isn't the worst it could possibly have been. Now that's not going to help. That's certainly not going to help. Good. Right. Do I still have a... Oh no, okay. Right. You go on there and on there. You go over to there. Starting to go wrong. There's just too many circles. And there's another one. And very little I could do about them. Right, this one's a problem again deal with that one fast because it's such a problem at one point that it's already giving me trouble. Okay. Okay, you down to there so you don't cause me a problem in a second. If I could close that line that would be useful. Which one of these two is going to cause me the problem first? And I'm guessing this one down here on the light green line is going to do me, but do me over. Yep. Well, that's pretty similar to the score I think I got yesterday or the day before. There's 1,815 passengers over 68 days. That was actually not not stressful. That one. I just want to check. Ah yes, yesterday was 1,818. So, at least my scores are over the 1,500 so far this week. Which, I think last week they were all, well, about three or maybe four of them were in the high 800s or 900s. There were about three scores that didn't even reach a 1,000. So I think I must be getting better at... Um, this with practice, or, or the fact I'm playing it once a day now rather than coming back to it once a week or once every couple of weeks, it must be helping. Because that didn't seem at all stressful to me, even though I failed after a while. It was sedate. At least it felt that way. So maybe I'm getting more used to it. I'm not saying I'm getting better, but more used to, used to it, the game again. Maybe not. Who knows? Anyway, that was my Mini Metro Daily Challenge for June the 14th, 2017. I think it's June the 14th. Yes, it is June the 14th. As always, I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I will see you down the road.